No way. Only is way too heavily nerfed. Yeah, no. He's been. We get Wreckers Yard again for the. What the fuck? I'm loving this, dude. This is great. The game's just giving me my favorite maps. I'm not complaining. I'm loving it. We're gonna get this gen out of the way because in the open, the pallet to my left, T or L to my right, to my ghost face. He's gonna be leaning. He's already exposed me. I'm gonna want to expose him for a terror radius. He's already been exposed. I'm gonna use a T wall and L wall. This is very risky considering I'm a one hit down right now, but I need to figure out how this ghost face plays. Especially whether or not he double backs. He. Ah! Oh, blade. Sloppy Butcher and Ruin. We see his totem right there. We should have waited a little bit longer to see if he'd really commit with his red light. Then it would have been a 50 50 on whether or not he bolts the window or double backs. So he's got, we also now know he's got Dying Light. So Ruin, Dying Light, Sloppy Butcher, and Nurse's Calling. If not Nurse's Calling, I'm calling Barbecue and Chili. Huntress has five hatches instead of seven because I'm running a French. Yep, that is correct. Huntress has five hatchets. You run the, um, the Iridus, Iridus and Heads. You lose like, you, lo you lose like four hatchets. I think you lose four, which leaves you with one. And then you had the infantry belt, which gives you two more. So you have three. And no for me to the ground for after release. Yeah, unfortunately. It's down hatchets to just Kappa. It's down hatchets are a meme. How do you know he has dying light? Because at the bottom right, we can see the dying light perk showing up. You probably can't see it too well because you have my Instagram and stuff popping up every second to the bottom right. But as you can see, when that actually goes away, you can see at the bottom right, you can see a little dying light there. Almost went second stage, dude. That was scary. I think it will make it, so I'll let him heal me. Even with Sloppy Butcher, it won't take that long. The guy's taking out the totem as well. And I'll heal the Dwight, and once he finishes that totem, we can then join us with double heals. New educational streamer. I always try to give my take. David's here as well. Move around so we can get double heals, and we can all... Now, I want them to come with me. Come with me, guys. And let's do this gen. We have three man this gen. We can start getting out some pressure, and that's what we're after. Come on, David. David, what are you doing? Oh, man. Yeah, nice. He turned the wrong way. I was trying to, I was going to hope that he was going to turn the opposite way. That way I'd farm her with bow time and he'd have no pressure. He's seen all of us know. He's going to rotate for me. I'm going to run through and break away. Good, he's mind gaming. I've now gotten distance on him. He's lost it. He's going back to the hook. All right, I'm going to search the chest. I want a flashlight if possible. I make it, that'll do. Gotta take a bit of time with his sloppy butcher though. Game down the game as much as some like fighting players do. Oh yeah. Um well, if you think I break down the game, you should go have a look at uh Fungus. He breaks down the game way more than I do. Like way, way more than I do. Just Twitch TV dash fungus. One word. What is duel? Dueling is uh, going exclamation mark duel at Uncharted for, I don't know, 10k points or 1k points or however, however many points you have. You can duel people and have some fun. It's another thing you can do. You can gamble, you can slots, you can duel. Just loop. If you use the strong goose, that's it. See? Like how Looney dueled me for 10k. Okay, he's coming for me. This time it's gonna be a bit different though. Yeah, okay. So that's how he likes to play, huh? Yeah. I need a pallet for safety. I won't make this. Ooh, I will make this only just. Yeah, he's going to be committing to me hard because he's going to want to get me down now that he's got me exposed. That's very, very key and important that I keep continuously gaining distance on this ghost face. Trying not to use any pallets. Trying. I don't think he's going to respect either, so... He might get me here. 
Double back, got him. Yeah, he's lost me. He spent too much time trying to get the blood loss so he won't make the hit. That's no brutal strength. But I'm pretty sure we already figured out his build. I'm gonna see if I can window fake him. Perfect. Come around, we'll take the window vault. He's faked it, double backed, we saw it. We'll come around and now vault the window. He's been in chase for quite a while, so he's gonna have blood loss. I should make this though. I make it, he vaults it, he doesn't vault it. He's getting really fast now. He's seriously starting to get some of that blood loss. He should double back this time. Double back expecting me to vault through the window. He's got speed now though, so I'm gonna be going for a juke because I know that I won't, won't make the window. Perfect juke. Ghostface has completely lost me. He still has his blood loss. Actually, he doesn't have his blood loss because he now lost Chase. I have enough distance to vault the window again. He's vaulting it. I come around. Does he double back vault it? He doesn't. He's losing gens to this. This is where I come through and take a window. He's lost distance because of that. I'm going to come around here. I'm going to stand still and bait it and sprint. I don't want to use Shack Pallet. There we go. That is the most effective way you can use Killer Shack. You cannot use Killer Shack any more effective than that. He's wasting too much time. He's going to throw the game. Got him to lunge. Gonna get him to lunge again. Now uh, he double backed. Now I'm gonna go back to this original loop. Ghostface needs to think about this. I'm gonna fake it. He's gonna double back. Ah, okay, good. Good job. And the last gen should go any second. There you go. He wasted way too much time on me. Don't cool down. There is a one minute cooldown. Camp hooks, but it's very toxic. It's... <laughs> it depends on how they play. So he's taking me basement. So all that for a one hook. So he literally threw away the entire game by committing to that. Now to face camp. Okay, so you can medium front inside the shack window if the killer is around the corner of the time you're at the window. Yep, you can, Sasha. You're exactly correct. I'm really hoping my teammate's gonna get that last gen. I have decisive strike, so if Ghostface comes back, I'm gonna hold him hostage in a locker. This is what I'm talking about with with the power of DS. He'll camp me at the locker. My teammates will finish the last gen. So now I need my teammates to go work on the last gen. My teammates go work on the last gen. I get my adrenaline. I sprint out of here alive against this Ghostface. My teammates try and help me. I die. It's as simple as that. All, he, all they need to do is just finish that last gen. Finish that last gen. I have a minute in here. I'm getting ready to hop out of the locker as soon as either my decisive strike runs out or as soon as that gen goes. If he has no it, he smacks me down and he wins. I don't think he does. I think we've confirmed he had Ruin, Sloppy, Barbecue, and Pop, I think. My time is running out. These guys need to finish that last gen as fast as they can. Now hop out. Oh, you fucker. But I'm kidding. DS. <laughs> Silly. All right, I'm pulling down Shack Pellet straight away. The only reason why I'm doing that is so I can gain distance on this ghost face by my teammates as much time as they can. I'm going to vault this pellet and force him to break it, or he's either going to try and bloodlust three this. He's breaking it. I need this door to be open now. It's close, but the door... Dwight should let me go through. Dwight should let me go through. Nia's blocking. Dwight, stop sandbagging. GG. Woo! Good to go to the last one. 